Hey guys, my name is Maisha. Welcome back to my channel. <laughs> I know it's been a long time, but in today's video, I'll be doing my hair and makeup and I'll be telling you guys where I've been. So without further ado, please don't forget to hit like, subscribe, comment down below, and please don't forget to turn your post notifications on so every time I post, you guys are notified. So I'm just taking my Design Essentials conditioner and I'm just gonna wash the hair. Okay, so the number one reason why I haven't been on YouTube is because I'm back in college. So yes, I'm finishing up my associate's degree. Then I'm gonna move on to my bachelor's and hopefully I'll move on to my master's degree. Um, I graduate with my associate's degree next year and I really um, have been just taking the time to study and take care of my kid and my household. A side note, so when you are washing a wig you want to make sure that you are getting into the lace you make sure it's super clean you do not want any chalky any you see how it's clear right here like we don't have any makeup or anything in the lace and it looks perfect so i'm going to take my claro bleaching powder and developer and i'm just going to put one scoop and then i'm going to mix it with developer and i'm showing you guys right here another reason i've been away from youtube is i feel like a lot of people don't watch my videos like i have like 8,000 subscribers but only like 10 people watch it the first day and then sometimes you know the next day i'll get like 30 but i'm like mo main mostly it's like family just family watching which is great but you know it's like i'm not getting enough people watching and it takes so much time to make videos and it's like you know i feel like i'm not getting anything out of it i mean like i i mean i'm getting something out of it because this is my hobby it's not like a job or anything but you know i just wish more people would like appreciate the time and the effort because i feel like some of my videos are like really good especially like my hair videos and breastfeeding ones and right here i'm just applying the solution so i'm just painting the hair basically not the hair but like the lace you want to make sure you do not get any bleach on the hair because if you do it will turn orangey and it will not look good and it will look messy i mean there are ways to fix it there's like a thousand videos on youtube of how to fix that but yeah so you're gonna want to let the bleach sit for 10 to 15 minutes so now i'm gonna rinse it out with warm water and then i'm gonna use my shimmer light shampoo to wash out the bleach Right here, I'm just taking my Red by Kiss Pro blow dryer and I'm just blow drying the hair. I just want to give the hair a good blowout. I usually do this when I do my wigs. Every time I wash it, I feel like it just completes the look and makes it look straighter and it looks better. So right here, I'm just showing you guys the different ways to part the hair and how amazing it looked. At first, I thought it was like too orangey, but then I'm like, you know what? It actually ended up going great with my skin and it looks pretty good. So I'm taking the perfect line stick in the color Meech and I'm going to apply it to the lace. I'm taking the LA Girl Pro concealer in the color Cool Tan and I'm just applying it to the lace. Right here, I'm just doing a ball cap method. I'm using the Erica J Lace Glue. This is hands down the best glue I've ever used. It's waterproof. It's amazing and it does stay on. A tip when you are doing a ball cap method is you wanna make sure you are not getting it on your hairline. You wanna do it a little bit before your hairline. So it looks like I'm doing it too far up, but I'm actually just protecting my edges. And you know what? I don't really mind. Honestly, it turned out perfect. 
and I like to do it a little farther up just to be safe. Right here, I'm just cutting out the ear tabs. So now you're gonna repeat this step. Um, you're gonna do it a total of three times using the Erica J lace glue or whatever lace glue that you're using. So the glue has dried up, so I'm going to apply the wig right now. So right here, I'm just brushing the hair back. I always hold it down in the front. I promise you guys it's going to look so much better once I'm finished customizing it. So right here, I'm going to use the Erica J band around the lace just to keep the lace down as it dry and sets in. So right here, I'm going to take off the band and I'm going to apply mousse and brush the hair. So now that I'm done with that, I'm going to use my Fenty Beauty Primer and I'm going to add it to my face. Right here, I'm just taking my Anastasia Beverly Hills Eyebrow Pencil in the color Dark Brown and I'm just doing my eyebrows right now. I was going for a more natural, bushy brow type of look. I'm taking my Fenty Beauty Concealer in the color 380 and I'm just applying it around my eyebrows. Now I'm taking my foundation in the color 380 and I'm just applying it to my face. And this is how everything looks so far.
Now I'm applying my eyeshadow using my Too Faced chocolate bar. I'm gonna show you guys on the screen the colors that I'll be using. I'm using my Total Temptation mascara and I'm just going to apply it to my eyelashes. Right here, I'm taking my Anastasia Beverly Hills eyebrow pencil and I'm going to use it as a lip liner. And right here I'm taking this cute pink lip gloss. It's from Dollar Tree. I don't know the name of the lip gloss. I had it for a long time and it was a gift to me. And I finally thought today, I'm like, let me just use it and see how it goes. And it turned out really well. So right here I'm applying this pore setting spray. I love this spray so much. It has my face so hydrated and they did recommend this to me when I bought it at Sephora. She said this is like the best setting spray and it truly is like it's amazing. So right here, I'm just brushing the hair. I'm trying to get it cute. I'm just fixing it up right now. And this is how the lace looks up close. It doesn't look too shabby. It looks really good. Um, I'm still a beginner. I'm not like a pro or anything. So that's just a disclaimer. I should have said that at the beginning of the video. Anyways, this face, this hair, everything was definitely giving me. I want to thank you guys for your continuous support. Please don't forget to hit like, subscribe, comment down below. And please don't forget to turn your post notifications on so every time I post, you guys are notified.